what's up guys? It is Wednesday, middle of the week, and I am driving to work. It is 6, I don't know, like 6.40ish, and I have to shift. Okay, so I'm driving on the 57 freeway, and it's it's not bad. I kind of hit that uh, five or six minutes before all the traffic hit. I got on the freeway, so I didn't really hit anything. I'm starting to hit a little bit, but I should be okay getting to work on time. Anyway, so I just had a thought. Um, I had just passed Cal State Fullerton on the freeway, and uh, I was thinking about this this morning, so I just wanted to kind of talk about it for a second. Um, in high school, in college, it's really, really easy to, I mean, at all, any time, let's face it, it's really, really easy to get into debt, basically, to be able to take out a credit card, to be able to take out a, you know, you got credit cards, you got student loans, and most of it is for stuff that doesn't matter. You know, it's for cell phones, iPods, uh, cooler laptops, uh, I don't know, whatever, what other things you crazy kids want to buy. And, you know, honestly, it's stuff you don't need, it's stuff that's cool now that you may not have to pay back now, whatever, just, you know, spend it and then you'll pay it back later. Yeah, that's true, but you're paying it back later with a percentage, sorry, and, um, you know, by the time you're done, you've paid back almost twice of what you originally owed when had you saved the money, not taken out the loan, uh, waited or bought what you wanted cash, um, you wouldn't have to pay back that interest, so you would then have, you know, pretend you would essentially have more money, um, because you would have spent less. That is true in business. Also, like, Katie and I, you know, when we started this company, one of the things we completely agreed on was no debt. No debt, period. If we can't pay for it cash, we don't do it. So all of the equipment we have, all of the software we have, um, everything that we do, we pay for cash. We don't loan anything, we don't have anything on, on, on a credit card for the business. We have debt that we're paying off um, and hoping in the next year and a half or so we'll be completely debt free, which would be amazing. So basically, you know, the thought is just try to stay out of debt because it limits what you can do. And if you have an idea for a business or you're trying to, I don't know, you're trying to get something accomplished, debt really holds you back. Debt sucks, basically. I hate debt, and if you cannot get in it, don't. Um, now, I know some people are saying, well, then how are you going to raise your credit score? you got to get your credit score up. Yes, that's true, and I agree having a good credit score is important, but do it smartly. Get a credit card, knowing that you're going to have to pay interest, so you're... you're you're knowing that you're paying more for something than what it's worth simply to raise your credit score, right? Anyway, just a thought. Um, I'm actually getting off on my off ramp right now, and it's only 6.45-ish. So that's pretty good. Um, got to work uh, pretty quickly. Wasn't a lot of traffic. So anyway, uh, I will talk to you guys later. Bye. I am on lunch. It is approximately, I don't know. 151. And uh, anyway, so I'm sitting in my car on lunch and it is raining like nobody's business out here. It is so rainy. Oh, yeah. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but or even see it out there on the. You can see it on the hood, I guess. Anyway. Um, it started raining just after I got to work, just before 7 o'clock, and it hasn't stopped since. At least I don't think so. Um, and it's raining pretty good. It's not super hard, but it's pretty hard, and uh, it just hasn't stopped. It's been consistent, so it's really wet everywhere. So, everyone, be safe driving this week, because all the, it's the first big rain since the summer, so the roads are going to be slick. I took, took a look at the uh, traffic earlier, and there was like an accident every few miles on almost every freeway. It's crazy. So, drive safe. Anyway... So one of the things I wanted to talk about is just kind of like uh, let you all know some stuff. So what we're going to start doing this weekend um, is we have two other YouTube channels, if you guys didn't know. Actually, there's three channels. This guy has no idea what he's talking about. Okay, back to me. We have uh, YouTube.com slash Dual Edge Studios and YouTube.com slash Dual EFX. Now, Dual Edge Studios is where Evil Dennis is going to go. So if you want to see Evil Dennis this weekend, uh, go subscribe to YouTube.com slash Dual Edge Studios. Oh, wait.
Okay, good. Now that you've gone and subscribed to Dual Edge Studios, uh, go and subscribe to Dual EFX. You can do that later. Uh, that's our behind the scenes channel. So anything we do that's like a making of or just like we're shooting video as we're filming, we just wanna put it up as a little montage or something, it's all gonna go there. The other channel that we run is called Studio School TV. Uh, it's Studio School, but that name was already taken, so the channel is youtube.com slash Studio School TV. Now what Studio School is, is we're just gonna go through, um, wow, it's starting to rain real hard. Ah, it's crazy! Ah. Okay, so anyway, what? Wow, it's gotten even harder. If I start floating away, go call for help. Anyway, so uh, what Studio School is is basically we're gonna start doing a uh, DIY do-it-yourself filmmakers channel. That'll give like tips and tricks, um, things you can do. But we're gonna go in really, uh, really in depth detail on how to do things. So we're gonna start um, by doing some screenwriting stuff because our next short film we're gonna start shooting in two or three weeks. Uh, it's called Groove Nut Butter. Um, I can't tell you much about it, but we're gonna go through the entire process of putting the script together uh, on Studio School. So from concept to putting out uh, like a, a beat outline to writing your character bios and then actually putting your script together and then doing like a, a scene breakdown, uh, breaking down your sound effects you know, from the script, uh, all kinds of stuff. So we're gonna go into a lot of detail, uh, setting up your shots, um, from the script onto paper where you want all that to go. So we're gonna do everything. We're gonna go through the whole thing. The ending short film will be like uh, Six minutes long something like that like six seven minutes long probably I don't really know because it's not written because we're gonna write it with you So um, you can head over to youtube.com slash studio school TV and check that out and that'll be pretty cool So anyway, I'm just sitting in my car uh, enjoying the rain kind of I had to run over here and not get totally wet, but yeah, it is, it is raining like something that rains really, really hard. I don't really know. Trying to be witty. Not working. Uh, tonight, uh, I may work on Evil Dennis some more. I finished, kind of finished, the last two thirds of it, uh, doing all the sound for it, but there's a couple of little tweaks I want to do to it uh, from the sound and then a couple of visual tweaks I want to get done. Uh, so we're going to do the first half. I may get that done tonight or tomorrow. Probably tomorrow is what I'm going to do. Um, tonight I'm going to post the blog. i post the vlog. Uh, may or may not post a new vlog, or a blog. May or may not post a new blog, but I am going to post the new vlog tonight. Um, other than that, i got to edit this vlog and then uh, get ready for tomorrow. Katie's got a meeting tomorrow she's going to be at all night, so I have all night probably with the house to myself to edit Evil Dennis. That's probably what I'm going to do. Anyway, I'm going to enjoy the last few minutes of my lunch here before I go back to work and uh, hopefully I don't float away. So anyway, see you later. Bye. So it is about 5.40 and I am about to head home. Uh, and I just saw on the internet uh, something really sad actually that Steve Jobs, the founder of Apple, uh, co-founder of Apple with Steve Wozniak, passed away today. That's a uh, that's that's horrible. So I just thoughts and prayers go out to Steve's family, friends, and just anybody who is affected by um, by Steve Jobs passing. And you know, it's it's really really sad. I mean, the man had a lot of medical issues that he was dealing with that unfortunately seemed to have caught up with him. He wasn't old. He was 56 years old. I mean, that's it's not old at all. It 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 serves as a reminder that if you're out there seeking money and that's all you're seeking, I'm not saying that he was, I'm just saying in general, if you're if you're out there seeking money and that's what you're seeking, then you think that's gonna make you whole, that money is what's gonna make you live forever, it's gonna fix all your problems, it's not. It's not at all. Okay, Steve Jobs had more money than most people will ever know in their entire lives. Most families will know in their entire lives and all of their generations combined. And He's 56 years old. He's gone through all these health problems, you know, and money couldn't fix it. Money is not the answer. So there's a, there's a huge money feel to this vlog today, or yeah, this vlog, overall vlog. Anyway, I'm gonna drive home. Uh, it stopped raining, thank God. So hopefully the traffic doesn't suck, and I will see you when I get home. All right, bye guys.
What's going on guys? So I am on my way home and uh, I thought these uh, clouds that are going on were uh, pretty intense. So there's a bunch of them over there and it just gets blacker and blacker. Dark all the way around. So anyway, these clouds up here are pretty dark. Anyway, it looks like it's going to rain. It looks like it's going to rain really, really hard. So yeah. today but we haven't had a like a big heavy rain in a long time so it'll be pretty cool if it does it kind of looks like uh the uh, beginning of independence day over here where the spaceships were coming out of the clouds because the atmosphere they were breaking through it anyway i'm being nerdy again okay anyway i'm almost home so i'm gonna be home and uh gonna eat some amazing dinner case making just making some burritos that we used to make all the time in a while, so really excited for that. So we're gonna do that. Watch some more of a movie. Probably won't do anything but work on the vlog tonight because I'm pretty tired. And uh, Katie's not gonna be around tomorrow night, so I want to spend some time with her. Anyway, okay, bye guys. What's up, guys? So I am uh, sitting here at the light, ready to turn to go home, and the rain has started. Anyway, it's uh, it's kind of going off and on, like getting you know going really harsh to really not so uh, so harsh. Anyway. The rain has begun. Okay, anyway, I'm almost home. Okay, bye. What's up, guys? So I just got out of the shower, and Katie and I are perusing Facebook. Yeah. Yeah. Make sure you can't see people's posts, because yeah. you're not friends with them. Oh. <laughs> wow, denied. <laughs> All right, so Katie was making food. I'm gonna go show them food. Hi. I just got home from work a little bit ago. Anyway, I'm gonna show what food. And there's Zach. Say hi. Hello. Hi, uh, that's Zach. Zach's amazing. Okay, so Katie, let me get some more light here. Katie's making chicken on the four mini grill, so there's some chicken, some chicken, and then she made some potatoes, and sweet corn, and black beans, and this is uh, caramelized onions, I think, right? These are caramelized onions? Slow cooked onions. It's amazing. Something just went in the microwave. What was that? Was that a potato? Was that a potato? Did you just explode a potato? Oh. Oh lord. Okay. Anyway, so I'm gonna start editing this vlog so I can get done, and Katie and I can just spend the night. So anyway, okay. Bye. I'm sitting here editing tomorrow's vlog. Yay. And I uh, just got done putting up the new one, so head on over to uh, the channel and go check that out. Um, although you're seeing this tomorrow and this will all have already been up, so you better have already watched it. Anyway, uh, so yeah, so I just finished putting up the blog there. Very exciting. And uh, just opened Encore, which I shouldn't have done. Anyway, so I'm editing uh, tomorrow's vlog, which is, yeah, see, I got a really nice, oh, face going on there. Um, not even gonna go into detail on that. Anyway, so uh, Katie's already in bed because she wasn't feeling well. We had a uh, dinner and it was amazing. Finished the Naked Gun. And uh, yeah, so I'm not gonna do much tonight. Just gonna finish editing this real quick and uh, get it ready for tomorrow. And then, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go to bed because uh, I should get to bed early. It's 8.34, probably gonna get to bed by like, uh, I don't know, 8.50 or so tonight. So that'll be really good. Anyway, uh, we'll talk to you guys tomorrow morning. Good night all. It is so rainy.